Hi besties. Um, I know I'm not looking my bestie <laughs> um, right now, but that's okay because we are going to do our makeup. I have a towel on. I'm tempted to put a t-shirt on because like, don't want y'all to think I'm naked. Um, I was going to do this in my room and try to like set up some crazy like setup with my camera, but I do my makeup in my bathroom every day. And please don't come here with the, oh, the steam from the shower, it's gonna ruin the, yeah, I don't care. This is where I do my makeup. I hope the lighting is okay. Okay, well, I almost just ruined everything I just set up. So, I put the ring light on, the brightest it can go. So, hope this is good. Um, okay, let's get into it. I have a t-shirt on now. I never do my hair before I do my makeup. I feel like it's back. Why would I do it to then have to worry about it? Like after a blowout, no. I'm already moisturized and everything, so that's done. But let's begin, let me get my makeup out. Oh, almost just ruined our setup. <laughs> okay. I feel like I keep it pretty simple. Where's all my shit? Oh, I have these brushes I've never even opened. They're Jeffree Star, so. I don't know how we feel about that. I'm not gonna open them. <laughs> I'll save them for a later time. Oh, here are my lashes. I'm gonna need those at some point. I wash and reuse. Oh, here's my donut. Okay, first we have to moisturize, and we did that. So, next, I'm gonna take my Kat Von D translucent powder. How's the battery life on this camera? Don't know. I'm just gonna take a little bit of translucent powder and put it all over my face. Right, right, love to see it. Beautiful. And then I'm gonna take this Morphe Jeffree Star setting spray. I'm gonna let that dry. Then we're gonna prime our face. And I've been running out of primers left and right. Feels like there's some in this one. <laughs> Dry, me God. Don't they know I'm doing a YouTube? Like, let's go. Um, I just got this shit in my mouth. Starberry scent. Starberry taste, Jeffrey. Blech. Okay, so we're gonna use the NYX Marshmallow Primer. I know I have a better primer downstairs, but we're already here, so. I also keep, oh god, I'm a mess. Oh, this one's good too. The Becca, there's shit all over it, Becca primer. We're gonna go with the marshmallow. Yeah, we're good. Oh, that came out really gross. Oh, ew. Okay, well, just put this all over. The worst is when I forget to prime my face because it happens all the time. I need to get a new primer ASAP. They didn't have the big one of this, so I had to get the minis when they came out. This is a good look. Oh, I should have done like a before and after. Well, just the before for now, whatever. This is the before. Hair in a thing, which I refuse to do my hair before the makeup. It just seems silly to me. I also had like an ingrown hair situation right there and it hurts. I think it's because I dyed my eyebrows. This sensitive skin. Okay, I'm primed. Now, I'm gonna go in with concealer. Oh, I left the concealer I wanted to use downstairs. That's fine. Oh wait, I think I have a mini of it. Okay, I'm going to take the Magic Wand, Magic Away, not Magic Wand, Charlotte Tilbury concealer. And you might be thinking, whoa, whoa, where's the foundation? Not yet, okay. I learned this technique from Harouche. She does the Kardashians makeup, or she did, don't really know. We start with a little bit of this. Who's texting me? Can't talk, doing a YouTube. <laughs> um, we start a little bit there. Then we go over here. We do a little bit of this. I don't really want to edit this, so um, anytime if you're bored and you want to skip to another step, go ahead. Because I don't really feel like editing this. This should just be a raw, like how I actually get do my makeup. Oh, hello? Maybe it's times I'll speed it up a little bit, but no. 
put a little under the brows. Ooh, let's put a little on my ouchie. Um, and I do have a neck pimple that is taking its sweet time going away and a scar over there. So let's just dab those while we're here. And that looks like something new trying to pop up. So let's just get after it. <sighs> it's hard being me. Now I'm going to take a Real Techniques brush and just kind of blend that a little bit. Nothing crazy, just no sharp edges is what I've seen is the vibe. It's hard because my mirror is here, but you guys are here. <laughs> okay. No matter how much I moisturize, my skin just always looks dry. Cue the comments telling me to go to the dermatologist, do this, do that. We love a, we love a helpful comment section. <laughs> That's usually not helpful. <laughs> okay, now let's take a little more setting powder and just, you know I'm not gonna do that yet. I don't ever do that now, so why would I do that now? Now we're gonna take this Revolution Beauty foundation stick in F13. It's just a very dark foundation stick I use to contour. Beautiful. Uh, can this hair go away? Oh, I put that a little too low. Well, yeah, those don't match at all. We're vibing, everything's fine. Gonna do the nose just a little. Love it, the neck always. Cause I gua sha, but it's never enough. I want that sick jawline that I'll never have. So we gotta fake it with the makeup, you know? Beautiful. <laughs> now we're gonna blend that with a different Real Techniques foundation brush, cause I use this one for my contour. We're just gonna blend a little bit, nothing crazy. Because we're gonna put foundation on next. But it's so interesting how we're gonna do this. This is not my technique, I stole it from Harush. Harush, if you missed me saying that earlier. I just use what she said to do. And it's very interesting. And you don't waste foundation this way, I feel like. It's great. But I feel like it makes my face look more snatched. Always blend into my neck back there. Love that for me. Go down. I tried to do like the triangle. Whoa, that looks scary, huh? It'll all work out in the end. Cause then we're gonna blend. All about the blend. Beautiful. I should, oh, that's looking great. Um, I should be in a little more of a rush because I have like content to to a brand today which wasn't really clear on the deadline, so love that for me. And last night, they said to me like, hey, we need that by end of day tomorrow, and I was like, no problem. So, I kinda gotta get on this and then take that photo. <laughs> oh, that's how I do it, I do a little flicky on the nose. A little flicky ticky. Love it. Well, that looks actually horrible today. That's how it always goes, you know? The makeup's gonna come out like shit because you guys are here. <laughs> yeah, perfect. Love it. <laughs> I look crazy. Don't worry. Everything works out in the end. I'm gonna blend my head a little bit. Always on camera, I look orangier than in real life. It's very frustrating. Like when I do a live doing my makeup, that's my favorite way to like film a makeup thing is like with you guys live. See, we're gonna blend now. We love a good blend. Beautiful. You know, the self tanner didn't really connect so great with my chest. Who the fuck is calling me from Illinois? Decline. I don't know anyone in Illinois. Scam likely, am I right? Okay, that's blended enough for me. It doesn't have to be perfectly blended because now I'm gonna go in with a little bit of foundation. I'm gonna use some of this Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Airbrush and look how great. 
quality control Charlotte. This was a fucking mess. Literally a week after I got it, the top of this got stuck in here and even when I pulled it out, it didn't work anymore. So you know what I have to do? I have to go like this. Oh yeah, and then just drag some off the top of that thing. And I'm just gonna put a little right there because we're just gonna put foundation in the spots. Well, I shouldn't have put that much there, but whatever. We're just putting foundation like in the fill-in spots because we already put concealer and contour everywhere. So this is just to blend it out with some foundation. And look, look at that, oh, snatched face. Like, okay, queen. Amazing. Blend it out with our head, forehead, whatever. Beautiful. That's honestly, it's it's such good foundation. Like, I haven't had to rebuy it yet, but it's literally so fucking good. It's expensive, but it's worth it. And I don't think expensive always means better with makeup. I really don't. But with that foundation, it's good, man. It's really good. Okay, now we're gonna go back in with a little concealer on my problem areas. <laughs> Cause nobody's perfect. I gotta work it. And I bought another NARS concealer, but it's downstairs and I'm lazy. So we're gonna do a little more under my eyes. Why don't I do this <laughs> every time I do it hella dramatic. Um, I should've set my eyelids. <laughs> we'll do that in a second. Let's go over on this little problem thing and over here a little and a little bit right there too. Any other things we can think of that are wrong with my face? Good. My dirty ass beauty blender. You know, I have a new one too. And for some reason I keep going back to the dirty one. And what is it? After you clean these to me, they still like, they just never feel like an, like good again. Like after they're super dirty. And even after you clean them, they still feel weird. Or just like super used. Why doesn't my hand match my face at all? My self tanner last night, I don't think I left it enough time to develop because I went to bed at like one o'clock and I got up at like 545. So, um, and then showered immediately. So that should have been enough time though. I don't know. Okay, here's the trick with pimples. Let the conceal. The fuck was that? Let the concealer sit a little, pat it a little baby bit, and then add a lot of powder. We're also gonna set our eyes. Beautiful. Masterful. A little over there, a little over there. Blendy blend. Okay, good enough for now. How's our ingrown hair doing right near our eyebrow? It's tough, it's gonna get in the way of the eyebrows, which we're doing right now, so. Good luck to us. I'm already sweating. <laughs> okay, the worst part of doing my makeup, my eyebrows. It's gonna be hard to, like I wanna be close to you guys so you can see this, but like, I gotta look in the mirror, so. I might be a little bit this way right now. And our turby twisties falling off. Love it. I hope the after is worth it on this <laughs> transformation. I have to burp. I want another coffee. I already had one today, and then I had a Celsius energy drink, but like, I got no, I'm being dramatic, I didn't get no sleep, I got almost five hours. My sleeping has just been like, not great lately. I don't know what it is, but it's just, mm-mm. Why does that look bad? <laughs> Where's the shape? She's giving nothing. I mean, I guess it's my fault. I'm the one drawing them. I just don't have much to work with here and I have to draw on the front of them every single time because I don't have any hair right there. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Ouch, ouch, ouch. <laughs> Only I get ingrown hairs in my eyebrow. It's gross. These don't look great. <laughs> I 
you know what, we try our best. And the rest is history. Why do they look so chunky? Ooh. Do I have chunky eyebrows? And like, I'm not saying like thick, like a nice thick eyebrow. No, these are like little chunky, chunky brows. Whatever, let's laminate them. <laughs> oh, that was a Morphe pencil and latte for my eyebrows. Oh, I'm in the wrong, I'm in the wrong makeup bag. Okay, I was using this Winky Lux eyebrow gel, but it's honestly kind of trash. Um, I really like this laminate brow from Revolution Makeup. I don't use the paint, I was gonna say crayon and pen, so I merge those words together. I don't use the pay on side. Um, we're gonna laminate this. Like it's like glue. That's why I like it. Cause the other one was just like putting like watery sh That don't look right in here. <laughs> Sorry if I'm covering everything. Yep, I am. Well, that's so me. You know what? Whatever. They are what they are. Those are them. And I'm done. And my turby twisty's falling off. Now the hair is free. I look scary in this fucking camera. Okay, next. I never set my eyelids like I said I was going to. Well, a little bit of powder. <laughs> meep, 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 meep. Okay. I usually do my eyeshadow. Then I do my cheek and highlighter, but I'll do my cheek now since I just set my eye. You know, I'm not mad actually about the ingrown hair pimple in my eyebrow, because that was easy to cover. Real pimples, not as easy. Okay, that just looks gross. I hate when the powder clumps and it just looks like white balls under your eyes. <laughs> you know? I'm sweating. Okay, time to dab on, oh. I didn't say what this is. This is Rare Beauty Liquid Blush Enjoy. And you have to be really careful with this stuff because it is potent. And you have to use very little. Like I wipe off all the product on the wand and then I, I have Real Techniques Blush Brush. I try to do the thing where you put it mostly on like this side, but like it's so like cherub and cute to have rosy cheek here too. So I do the blush all over. Get a little on the nose because <laughs> I'm obsessed with blush, especially liquid. Should I use powder blush on my nose? I just feel like it doesn't stay as well. Rosy, goddess. And then, oh, do I need Botox right there? What the fuck are all those wrinkles in my mouth? I'm going for Botox next Wednesday. I'm gonna vlog it for you guys. And I'm going alone, <laughs> like everywhere else I go in my life. Uh, okay, a little more on this side. And then on the nose, chin, and I do a little on my forehead. But like just the residue, like I don't put fresh liquid on the, just cause like, ooh, sun kissed. <laughs> you know? I feel like I look like a sewer rat with my hair wet. So she goes, my hair's wet, it looks so dark. I need these roots done. Ah. <laughs> okay. Now we're gonna use our Rare Beauty highlighter. Or should I do that last? No, we're gonna do it now. No, we're gonna do it last. <laughs> okay, whatever. Now we're gonna just, this is how I do my eyeshadow lately. Um, it's really not like an eyeshadow look. It's just easy. I take this mini NARS Laguna bronzer. I got the mini size to use it as eyeshadow. And I just literally put it all over my eye. Because if I don't, it's like white eyelid, orange face. So, you know, we need some depth. Then we'll also highlight in spots. Then we'll do a sickening eyeliner moment and lashes. Because that's just my go-to look. I just like it. And should I probably get eyelash extensions because I put on fake lashes every other day? Yeah, but I've had them and they're really fucking annoying. 
they're always falling out, getting into my eyes. I have contacts, they bother me. You can't like put your face in the shower because then the soap gets, uh, I hate them. They're very convenient, especially in summer, but like I just hate them. They're so annoying. I'm sweating. What now? Oh, highlight it. Where's my donut palette? This is I Heart Revolution Chocolate Custard Palette and it's smushy. Okay. Where's my little highlighter? I have used this literal one, like really old, like Mac Holiday. It doesn't even say Mac, oh, it faintly says Mac on it from like a holiday set brush. And we just go under our chunky, chunky brow, like so. Highlight it with that color. Cause it's like a fleshy highlight. It's not like, like it's a chill highlight. It's not too like aggressive. Is it? I don't know. That's kind of aggressive. It's giving me daytime stripper, not nighttime club. So we're on the right track. Oh, and then I take the darkest color in here. <gasps> my nose is so itchy right here. Yeah. Um, at least my nose isn't running because it's usually like running like a faucet while I do my makeup and then I have to shove toilet paper up my nose. So be grateful that's not the vibe. And then I always use like this brown liner or any like dark liner and I try to give like a blueprint for my eyeliner so I have something to follow and then I can smudge it if, if it looks like horrible because that's just easier for me. I used to use gel eyeliner with a brush which was so nice. I really need to go back to that actually. But lately I've been using, why does my camera keep flashing? Are you okay girl? Yeah, my battery life is good. I have an hour left on the memory card. What is their deal? Anyway, I do that with the eyeliner to give the blueprint for this Maybelline eyeliner that I don't honestly recommend, but I bought it, so I use it. This is gonna be hard to show. Just bear with me. A little, can you hear my neighbor's music? What the fuck are they listening to? that's coming from <laughs> it's not good it's giving me like Walmart West Side Story like are you taking a request I could do a little Celine Dion right now see like that's fine and if we hate it we'll just smudge it a little on the edge yeah whatever fine I know what you're thinking. What an aggressive fucking wing. Yeah, well my lashes are aggressive, so it kind of like covers it. So I need an aggressive wing for it to even look like I'm wearing eyeliner. We're so close and personal right now, Jesus. I never prime my eyelids. <laughs> That's why they always like, like the eyeliner goes like all over my crease. And I get the comments, well why don't you just prime them? I don't know. Why do people rob banks? I just do what I do. Why does anyone do anything? Every day I just feel more and more like life isn't real. <laughs> like all this, like it doesn't matter. Like I am a speck on a floating rock. So I'm just gonna do whatever I want in life, do my best, be happy, and that's it. Cause you know, I feel like a lot of people my age aren't on, or like uh, live near me, aren't exactly doing like TikTok and YouTube, but this is what makes me happy. I'm not a weirdo, I'm having fun. And that's that on that. People are gonna talk no matter what I do, no matter what anyone does, so who cares? Right? Right. <laughs> Beautiful. Kind of, ugh. good enough. Um, you know, 
that stinks. I canceled a date I had tonight just because I don't like getting bad vibes. But now it's like, where am I going to wear this makeup to? I have somewhere to go at 5 o'clock with my mom, but that's just like us like hanging out, not like, you know. Okay, time to do my eyelashes. <laughs> I use Christina Lashes number 43. I wish I had um, a new pack up here with me to show you them, but it's downstairs and I'm using a pair that I wore yesterday. I just tear off all the glue and keep it moving. Cause I also have to cut them a little bit like to fit my stupid little eyes. Someone on TikTok said I had bug eyes and I was like, bitch, where? Like maybe now that I have eye makeup on, but normally they're like so squinty. And I have a pea head, like a very tiny head for my body, I feel like. I don't know. I don't know. Let's glue the lash with some Duo glue. I've never used any other lash glue but this, so I don't know if this is the best. It's just the only one I use. Okay, the glue is on. The glue is on. How long have we been filming for? Probably a while. 26 minutes, love it. I guess I can cut some of this out, but like, why? This is what you guys want. <laughs> Giving the people what they want. Give her a shake, let her get tacky, as the gurus say. I've never worn this shirt before, it's from Target. It's kind of sketchy. <laughs> I feel like it's like, it looks like a men's shirt. And just the sleeves are awkward. Okay, anyway. Let me put this on. You're not gonna see it. Unless, maybe you will, I don't know. It's hard to show. I feel like I really need to start using like tweezers to put these on. But my fingers just do the trick. And then I feel like the glue never looks kosher. So I'll go over it with my liner after it dries. The heat is on. It's hot today. I feel like that one was a little well, fuck. You know what, that's the best we're gonna get. <laughs> it'll dry, it'll be great. And then we'll go over it with the eyeliner. I'm so behind on all the TV shows I watch. Mostly reality garbage, but like I haven't like kept up with like any of them. <sighs> I think for my lips today, we're just gonna go with tried and true Charlotte Tilbury, but we are gonna do lip gloss because we're feeling crazy. And I'm torn between doing um, this beautiful Fenty Beauty Diamond Milk. I did it yesterday and I liked it, but then I have this Carly Bible Il Maquillage. It's just so pretty. We're gonna use this today. That was an easy sell. But Miss Rihanna, you were really gorgeous yesterday, but today it's Carly's turn to shine. The heat is on. Why do I keep singing that? Okay. I feel like the makeup's almost done, so this isn't actually that long of a tutorial. We're gonna go in with our highlighter now from Rare Beauty. Yeah, actually, this doesn't actually take me that long, I guess. It's only been 29 minutes. We're just gonna go there in a little bit. There. A little bit of a glazed donut effect, if you will. That's what my little brother would call it. Oh, like the girls who look like a glazed donut. It's like, yes. Oh, actually, I forgot one step, and I always almost forget until I get right here. Because I put a little bit of brown eyeshadow on my lower lash line, and I never remember. I don't take fresh. I just use whatever is left from when we were doing our thing, and I just a little there and I only remember when I'm doing I don't know where it just cut out but it cut out somewhere I hope we're good I'm still just doing this 
maybe it's like a 30 minute thing like it stops after 30 minutes and they have to redo it i think that's the vibe of this camera i really hope that's the case because if all that isn't there just kidding <laughs> i need to check if it's there actually hold on one second okay we're good i feel like this is a little bit crooked it is huh well not a ton i can do about that right now that's oh well fuck so i shouldn't have messed with it okay there we go we're good it's recording <laughs> okay so we just did a little on the lower lash line we highlighted but i didn't blend the nose i see a little flicky flicky flick on the sides Regina. Okay. Now we are going to. Uh, oh, lips. Duh. Is this dry yet for us to. Do? Let's do the eyeliner over that. Not that you'll be able to see it probably at this angle. Or maybe you can. I just try to like go over it. Because this glue supposedly dries black, but like, does it? You know? Always looks like, like eye bookers connecting the lash. Like nasty glue. I should buy the black glue next time. I used to get that in college. It's smarter. Okay, sorry, I'm here, I'm with you. Time for our lips. I didn't think I overlined my lips until I went on TikTok and was um, annihilated by a user who was like, you overline your lips, you have really tiny lips. And I was like, oh. miss, tiny lips? Where? Say that to my bottom lip again and see what happens. Okay. I just try to like follow it the best I can. I think I overline on my top a little bit. I can't talk while I do this. But because they're kind of uneven. I don't think I overlined that much. She was like so dramatic. Honestly, don't even get me started on the video I posted of me trying the Dior lip tattoo before. I've never tried it before, right? It's like a lip stain, it's very wet. So the second I put it on, I dabbed it with my finger a ton because it was like a super wet product and I didn't want it to dry like streaky. Holy shit, I've never been roasted so hard for putting on a lip stain in my life. And of course, people that don't even know what the product is, they're like, why do you put on lipstick like that? Me. So that was fun. <laughs> Let's refrain from those comments here, shall we? YouTube is a safe place for us. At least we hope it is. <laughs> okay. I have a little too much chapstick on, so it's making it hard to line my lips. Good enough. Okay, that was Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat and Pillow Talk, iconic. Then we're gonna use the Pillow Talk lipstick from Charlotte Tilbury, also iconic. It's just so good. And it's a lipstick that looks good on everyone. And she makes it in medium and dark too. I have the medium one. I always get like weird on the corners of my mouth. Beautiful, yes, no. And I'll take our lip gloss and then we're done. And then I'm going to blow out my hair and come back like looking normal. <sighs> that is so pretty. I feel like I'm serving like a little bit much for a Thursday <laughs> afternoon, but it's so pretty. Like, look at that lip gloss. Okay. I'm going to dry my hair and then I'm going to come back. Okay, my hair is done. This is the finished product. Um, 
I have my newly <laughs> curtain bangs that I am still getting used to. Um, but yeah, I just want I put on like a tank top and it, why does it look like my like I don't have anything on? <laughs> um I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment. Actually, comment below if you want more makeup videos, skincare routine, just whatever you want to see on here, tell me. Because I know I have a lot more of you now from TikTok, which we love, all my besties. Um, so comment down below what you want to see on this channel. And yeah, I love you so much, and bye. Thanks for watching. Mwah.